Hi everyone, Zori Mori here. Welcome to my channel. Today I have for you a mini try-on. I'm gonna show you the latest pieces I got from Cezanne and their fall collection. I already had a few videos dedicated to the fall collection releases. That's because I'm trying to match my filming pace to the way Cezanne is releasing their collections. Let me know what you think about that. You might have seen a few of the pieces styled on my Facebook page. If you're not part of it, I'm gonna link to it in the description box below. I hope you join us on there. I share content daily related to personal style and fashion. I let you know if there are any discount codes or sales going on, brands I think you're gonna like if you enjoy Cezanne. I'm also gonna link my Instagram account if you're active on the platform. I would love to connect on there as well. And I'm going to link my fantastic cardigan. It's by Francis Valentine. I had it for a while. It's 100% wool, really, really great quality. It's like one of these heirloom pieces that you can pass from generation to generation. And currently I have a discount code for it. So I'm gonna share that with you. If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. I'd love to see you around more. Now let's get into today's video. This here is the Diego jumper, size extra, extra small, my usual size for Cezanne knits, especially when they are the boxy cut, like the Diego. This is not a new silhouette, we've seen it before. Cezanne released it in two colors last winter, I got the cream, I ended up wearing it a lot. It's perfect for winter, it's very warm, it's on the heavier side, it's really cozy, and um, it's really, really soft. It has no itch, 100% merino wool. The red shade is fantastic. It has orange undertones, classic addition to anyone's closet, just like the cardigan I'm wearing. These are pieces I'll keep returning to season after season. You can get tired of a sweater like this. This is the Louise blouse, size 34, my usual size for blouses by Cezanne. It's 100% cotton. It's lightweight, but it has structure. We have a gathering that's elastic around the neckline. Three-fourths sleeve, it cuts around the elbow. Again, we have an elastic gathering. It's really, really beautiful blouse. It's a multi-season piece. For now, you can layer it under a cardigan. And then for spring and summer, you can just wear it as is. I keep getting inspiration on different ways to style it. So for me, this is a 100% key. This here is the Basil cardigan, size extra, extra small, which is my usual size. The color is light beige. And for those of you who follow me, you already know I have the khaki version. This design is based on the a hill cardigan. It's a piece that I wear on rotation. The new updated silhouette really, really resonated with me. I love that it's less bulky. It's easier to tuck in. You can wear it buttoned, unbuttoned. I love the texture that it adds to every outfit. So I am a basil convert, big fan. I think between the beige and the khaki, I can cover a wide range of outfits in my closet. I think it also will make a fantastic gift for those of you who are already starting to think about the holidays. The basil should be on your radar. This here is the Tabata skirt, size 34. It's a new silhouette, new midi skirt by Cezanne. Beautiful colors, 100% viscose. There is a slit right here. Initially, when I saw this skirt in the Kizers, I was really sold on it. I thought this will be it. I am keeping it. However, after getting the blouse and the skirt, I decided this print looks better around my face. So I decided to keep the blouse. I'm going to send the skirt back mostly because I have too many midi skirts. I have to be really, really picky on what I keep in my closet. This here is the Giulietta jumper size extra, extra small. It's my usual size. If you follow me, you know I have the green and white flower version of this and I really, really like it. I was debating in my head, will I still like the green after I get this one? And I'm happy to report that I still do. I really like the statement quality of the green and white. I like how the flowers pop. And even though this is a really good monochrome neutral version, I think I'm gonna send it back. I'm only gonna keep the green one, I think, 
I need some space in my um, sweater uh, drawer because there will be a lot more knits coming up. It does have a little bit of itch for those of you with sensitive skin. If you want a sweater without any itch, go for the Diego. It's so soft. Or go for one of the cotton blends. They are also great for sensitive skin. All right, everyone, this is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section below what you think of Suzanne's fall collection so far. Did you shop it? What did you get? Are you waiting for something to be released? I want to know. In the description box below, you're going to find a link to my Facebook group and Instagram. I hope you join us on there. I would love for us to connect on multiple platforms. If you enjoy watching today's video, give it a thumbs up. It really helps my channel. Consider subscribing. I would love to see you around more. Have a wonderful week and see you next time.